Hey guys, so you all know that I'm in the UK, but my social worker, Tom, has contacted me today with an emergency. And as we helped the three babies who were premature not long ago, the doctor remembered us and called us from the ward to tell us about baby Nuriadi. And she was premature a month ago, but she's a month old now. And her mum, uh, Miriam, has sold all of her furniture in her home and is spending every single day at the hospital with her daughter. She's a twin. Her twin sister is doing fine, uh, but Nuriati is not. Now, Nuriati has hydrocephalus and the hospital, the doctor who called us has told us that the hospital have refused to do any further treatment because there's already an outstanding bill for the intensive care. And thankfully, Nuriati's uncle paid for the intensive care she's had up until now, which undoubtedly saved her life. But he's now absolutely broke and can't afford anything. He can't even provide food for his sister, uh, Nuriati's mother. So she is at the hospital every day. She is hungry, she's not eating, and she's breastfeeding twin girls at the same time. And she's doing all of this in the hope that she can save her daughter's life, ultimately. So I've had to start a fundraising page for New Riyadi because we just can't afford the medical costs that are involved. The doctor who contacted us just needed our say-so so he could start doing some treatment as he'd been told not to treat New Riyadi by the uh, hospital administration and he didn't want to see her die for the sake of money and nor do we. The means to treat her exist in the hospital but the thing that's blocking it is that the mother doesn't have the money or ultimately bits of paper with value were signed to pay for her treatment. In exchange for her treatment they need the money which is a horrible state of affairs for the world we live in but not what this video is about. This video is about letting you all know about New Riyadi and us doing what we are supposed to do and being a voice for her and her mother and her sister and a bridge between those who can help and those who need help. Without surgery, New Riyadi has hydrocephalus. So she's already had basic surgery to relieve the fluid in her brain. But without a shunt being placed in, uh, she more than likely will die. And this is what we are trying to avoid happening. The fundraising page as well, we've added a little extra because as I say, her mother has sold everything. So her single room, she even sold her bed and mattress. So her single room is just an empty room with some pots to cook now because she sold everything. Her husband abandoned her when she was pregnant. So... Yeah. So I'm just purely making this to say there is a fundraising page for baby New Riyadi because it's quite urgent that we get her into surgery and first of all get rid of the pain that she's facing and secondly uh, ensure that she can grow up with her twin sister and her mother and she has every right to do so just because she's born into poverty doesn't mean that she doesn't have that right to life. Yeah, so never done a video like this before, but uh, needs must, as I'm not in Tanzania, I couldn't go with the video camera. So this is Baby New Riyadi, and her fundraising page will be in the description below in the video. God bless, guys. Bye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe, as it really helps us to grow the channel and with it help more children here in Tanzania. Also, don't forget you can support our work by sharing with children in crisis here. Be it sharing for a particular need or even sharing one-on-one -on -one support for education, housing, food and medical care. It can be done for as little as the cost of a cup of coffee a week back in the West after all. Just visit www.sharetanzania.co.uk to find out more. Lastly, remember you can also support us via Patreon, www.patreon.com forward slash feathers tail and help keep us here in Tanzania to continue our work. The links for the website and for the Patreon are in the description box of this video.
Love and light, guys. See you soon.